Hello and welcome to another episode of Borg Tries to Fix It. So today it is arts and crafts time. So what we're going to be doing is if you look at the glove box, there's two little holes here where we have a emblem that goes in there. They do not remake this emblem. I can't find it anywhere. Obviously I could buy one that's in better condition, but before I go to that trouble, we're actually gonna try and paint this. So let me bring you in close, show you what this one looks like, um, and then I'll kind of put you aside while I paint it. All right, so here it is. You can see a lot of chip paint. And it's, you know, the, the metal's okay. It's in okay condition. I think if I paint it, it'll be okay. Um, so the paint we're gonna be using is the Duplicolor Metal Cast Red Anodized. And then for the borders and the actual S part, it's just the Duplicolor Engine Enamel Gloss Black. All right, so without further ado, let me put you back on the tripod and we'll get to work.
Okay, so we are done. You saw me using a, um, I didn't talk about it, but I used a paint pen, just an acrylic paint pen, to just darken where it says Cutlass here. You also can't buy this. You can buy ones that say 442 or Cutlass Supreme, but not the one that says Cutlass. And then this came out pretty good, not perfect. The, uh, the red anodized paint, super, super watery. So I had to go many, many light coats. I think I did four coats of the red on this, but I think it came out pretty well. So now I'm gonna glue this up to the, um, to the glove box and we will get it put back in the car. Okay, the dash is done. Glove box is in, things look pretty good, and it even opens and closes. So excellent. So that's gonna do it for this one. Thanks for watching. Um, that took entirely longer than it should have, but anyway, it's done. Um, Next, I have no idea. Maybe we'll go and finally paint the trunk so we can run the electrical down there. Um, anyway, thanks for watching. Have a good one. Bye.